Hello everybody, and uh, welcome back. Um, today we're not going to be uh, playing a scary game, but we're going to read one. Yes, this is the um, the Bong Jong Dong Ghost. Well, it says right there. But, um, so, I haven't been... So yeah, but I've just decided to uh, do something different. I was going to play a happy game, but... I thought, now nah, keep the scares up. So, uh, we're going to be reading this uh, scariest comic. So, here we go. Warning, this webtoon is a special horror episode for this summer season. Oh, too late. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's still summer. It, since it contains shocking scenes, the reader description is advised for pregnant women, the elderly, or those suffering from serious medical conditions. Well, it's a, <laughs> I shouldn't be playing this. It's like, you know, five past nine. <laughs> right, mystery sketch. Bong Jong Dong Ghost, written and illustrated by Hu Rang. The story is based on true eyewitness accounts. We're gonna. But this is based off a happy thing. Just gonna crank up the volume. Here we go. It was around 11.20 that night. I was dragging myself home, exhausted after a tiring night study sessions at school. But there was. But there was no one on the street, which I thought was strange. I usually see a lot of people. Even at night, since my apartment complex is pretty big. Anyways, feeling scared, I kept looking down on the ground whilst walking home. Suddenly, a shadow stretching towards me caught my eyes, although there wasn't anyone around me. I looked up to see who, who that was. Hello! <laughs> well, she's um, been practicing, um, well, athletics a lot. That, that, that was probably terrible. A very terrible joke. I saw a woman walking in front of me, but she looked a little strange. I could see that I could say that she looked crippled. She was limping and struggling to walk in front of me. Oh God, I don't like that leg. Ugh. What pretty eyes! Since she was walking very slow, I soon caught up with her. Up close, I was able to see her better. She was wearing dirty pink pajamas and looked as if all her joints in her body had been twisted. Worse, her hair was in a mess, sticking out everywhere. Oh God, the hair! It seemed so weird that I stopped walking. I felt like I shouldn't get any close to her, nor did I have the guts to pass her by. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, this is going to be an interesting comic. I can feel my... <laughs> right. You know people say that if you're really surprised you can't even scream? That was right. I froze there, not being able to move. My heart is like pouncing incredibly. Oh, Where is my baby? My thoughts were racing to a question. Oh my god, I don't even know what I was thinking. When I did that, it gives me the chills thinking about it. <laughs> I answered, pointing as far as I could. Uh, over there. <laughs> God, that face. <laughs> and she's still got the twisted neck. I just wanted to, her to get away from me. Then she limped towards where I pointed to. And, and I couldn't see her anymore. Fearing that I might run into her again, I tried to turn around and leave the apartment complex. I could not think of anything but to get to a place where there would be people around. At that moment, she's not here. I heard her screaming from far away. Ah! Oh, not up close. That. That's not funny. Not funny. I don't remember anything from then on. I heard that my neighbour found me passed out on the ground and took me home. Was that? Oh, no. In 2007, an apartment complex of Bongjiung Dong Go Waka Ake Gu Soyol. I'm sorry if I, um, my Chinese fans over there or Japanese. Is this Chinese or Japanese? I can't tell. Maybe Korean? Is it Korean? Come back. Uh, um, whoever, I'm sorry if I read that wrong. A 33-year-old woman jumped off the apartment complex and died on the spot. Known as surname Cho, a divorce due to her extra material affair, she had lost her custody of her two-year-old daughter and decided to commit suicide. 
after after that incident oh my god her leg her leg oh. after that incident cho was seen walking around that apartment complex several times after that incident cho no, oh it's the same thing hey <laughs> yay the end oh my god <sighs> what a scary comic <laughs> Oh my god, what a scary comic. <laughs> uh, uh. Alrighty then. Well, that ends it for um, this episode here. Um, if you feel like that you're brave enough to um, read the comic yourself at like 10 past 9 or 5 past 9 p.m., uh, go ahead and read it. Um, I will give uh, the link to this uh, website in the description below so you can check it out yourself and might be brave and maybe be braver than me <laughs> and uh, make sure you subscribe to join the spark gaming family or or if you like this video why don't you give it a like and share it around with your friends of, of how this guy got incredibly scared <laughs> about this comic anyways I will see you all in the very next video goodbye everybody <laughs>